breaking news to get to right now in the race for the White House. Protesters challenged GOP candidate Jeb Bush during the National Convention for the Hispanic Chamber of Commerce, which is held in downtown Houston. At issue, the debate over immigration. Channel 2's Phil Archer was there for the protests and the speech and is joining us live now. Phil? Well, you know, former Governor Bush is married to an immigrant, and he pass, backs a path to legal residency for undocumented immigrants in this country. But protesters disrupted his speech here for a while today, claiming he is not saying enough about immigration reform. Just minutes into his speech, former Governor Bush was interrupted by protesters waving signs and chanting, no hope without the Latino vote. Here's what I believe. I believe we need immigration reform. I've been clear about this. About a dozen protesters representing groups that include the Service Employees Union and the immigrants' right group, FIEL, were finally escorted out of the ballroom by security. Caesar Espinosa says they came today to confront Bush on immigration reform. Sometimes he's really nice to us, sometimes he's very mean to us, so we want to get an answer or a clear answer of why, of where he stands on the immigration. Jeb Bush is one of the few Republican presidential candidates who supports a path to legal residency for illegal immigrants. After the protesters were ushered out, Bush laid out his plan, seeming to take aim at Donald Trump's call to wall off the Mexican border and deport up to 11 million undocumented immigrants. We need to respect the rule of law. There's national security questions, public health questions. There's, there's important questions about protecting and securing the border. But we don't need to be, build a wall. We don't need to deport every person that's in this country that would cost hundreds of billions of dollars. That's not a practical conservative plan. Today was not the first time Governor Bush had been interrupted by immigration activists. It happened back in June when he first announced he was running for president. And Governor Bush has been critical of President Obama's executive order a couple of months ago that allowed millions of undocumented immigrants to remain in this country. Reporting live downtown, I'm Phil Archer, KPRC Channel 2 News.